Hello, I'm Kasia and welcome to the Trawlsfitted Ranges in North Wales, where we will be talking to some of the drivers taking part in the Formula 1000 Junior Media Training Day. Well, Paul, you're the first guy into the stage this morning. Conditions looked a bit tricky out there. How was it for you? Yeah, not so bad. It's a bit slippy in a few places. After the torrential downpour we had earlier. It's really tough because it is so narrow and uh, there's no room for error. But it's good to perfect all your skills. I'm here with Kasia, um, one of the leading lights in the Junior Championship. Great weekend for you last weekend. It was really good, actually. It was quite challenging. It started off uh, really quite dry. and. And then as soon as the heavens opened, the showers came. It started to really downpour with rain. Then we managed to claw a bit of time back. And so it was all about car control and getting the lines right was essential, uh, just to get a really good time. At the end of the day, we were leading by one by seven, so it was a great day. Yeah. Well, we can see a lot of smiling faces in this car, so um, that looks as though you really enjoyed yourself out there. Uh, yeah. <laughs> We just need to get a lot more practice in and be, gain a bit more confidence and it'll be good. And what's the long term plan then? Obviously you've got some short term plans there for the juniors, but um, where do you see yourself going with rallying? Uh, well, I'm hoping to do BRC, uh, BTRDA maybe, we'll see Super 1000 maybe. BRC. Uh... I'm not too sure yet, we'll, um, we're going to focus on finishing the junior championship first and uh, see, where, see where that takes us really. Yeah, but I won't take it as far as I possibly can. So is the plan to return next year? Oh, I'm 17 now. So this is your last year. It's first year and last year. It's my last year. Yeah. So I can't. But um, yeah, I might go into seniors, but it all depends on budget. If it goes that way, be professional, and you know, it's, it's everyone's dream, isn't it? But we'll just see uh, see which way it goes, really. And you've got a very experienced co-driver alongside you. Does that make a big uh, a big difference for you on the stages? Yeah, it helps a lot. Yeah. It's just like helping me with my clutch controls. I like, need to be a lot easier on it. So more careful. Worth about another. 30 seconds or so. <laughs> That's pretty impressive. All right, well, thanks for talking to us. We'll see you in a bit. Uh, thank you, How do you feel about um, being part of the Formula 1000 Championship? So, I mean, you've come up through juniors and you're doing rally first. So, without probably Tristan and uh, uh, doing the juniors, uh, I would I would have no experience whatsoever and I would probably be fail the stone had last all the time in the forest. I mean, it's just a brilliant experience. We, like when I was I started when I was six yeah I did the first ever year so I only had one year in it which is sort of a shame really but it's it's one of the things where everything I learned I still carry forward when I'm rallying now. I think the junior championship is a fantastic um, one to be in for all junior drivers. It's you can gain a lot of experience and it's nice to have the support from everyone really. It's really fun. And what do you think about uh, learning pace notes? Because I'm sure that's something quite different from the driving sense. Do you think it's a good experience to have? Yeah, we've been out with Alistair. <laughs> we went out for a good hour and a half. Yeah, it's a big learning curve. I didn't realise how much hard work actually goes into it. You first write the pace notes, then you read the pace notes. And... Prepare me for seniors especially. It's a really good experience to have. And you're still smiling despite the rainy weather we've had. Yeah, it's not so bad. I think it's going to get worse though, but we'll just get more and more time in the seat, so it'll be fantastic. I learnt all about the Swedish uh, ice driving school, which sounds really good experience. Thanks to spending time talking to some of the representatives here. Tell me how much you've enjoyed the video training day. It's been absolutely brilliant. A quite fun day out. It's, it's brilliant that a championship like this will put on three days. It's been absolutely fantastic. It's, I've loved it. It's, it's been a lot of fun. Yeah, I've definitely got a lot to learn. There is no doubt that the Formula 1000 Junior Media Training Day, which has been a great help for many of them. 
In true Formula 1000 fashion, the day would not be complete without more four-wheel fun and a chance for drivers and their families to relax around a barbecue. Anyone here involved in health? <laughs>